All right, so um, possible scalping, sorry, swinging scenarios using Marcus Cypher. Let's let's talk about it. Possible swing scenarios. And um, again, if you're new to this channel, the name is Elon Upa, um, um, a former server moderator and also consultant for one of the best trading scripts. A trading script is a reference data that gives you insight into the very direction of an asset. So <clears throat> um, direction means um, every asset either goes up or down. So the price of the asset, of course, trading is about up and down, up, down, consolidate. So how do you know if it's going up and how do you know if it's coming down? And how do you know it's going to consolidate? Let, let's take consolidation out of it. Basically, every asset goes up, down, and I can demonstrate with you. This is up, price went up, this one went up. Also, this one went up. This one also went up. This one also went up and came down. So it was like this one came down. This one came down. This one also went up. So the question is, how do I identify the uptrend and the downtrend? Basically, that's how you probably characterize um, trading up, down, down like this, and up. So the reason why I'm saying how do you identify is most people don't know they think it's going up because someone on youtube said it's going up so long they think someone in their telegram group said it's going up they think someone <clears throat> you understand so and who is that person basically that person is not a genius than you he 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 is not a person he's not a determinant of the market remember them wall street is the market the market is wall street and um just because some guy on youtube is saying going is going up doesn't necessarily mean he is the wall street wall street is a group of people uh, not necessarily a group of people but it's like trading is basically a group of people all over the world trying to predict the uptrend of a price of an asset using their various skill set and their various scripts so if 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 you as a person you probably understand trading from your own perspective you might be using your own different scenarios blah 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 stuff like that to you justify why it's going up and now and a lot a lot of people are all over the world tra trading using different forms of um, data but Michael Cypher simplifies it by showing simple simple strategies and um this is what the world has this this what this is where the world has reached in terms of trading you understand technology is always going to simplify stuff so I'm going to show you possible trading scenarios that you could have probably entered a trade using a higher time frame I'm um, using I think the for our time frame so this is how i'll probably have entered a tree if i was using those scripts sorry um the time frame swinging yes and so the first one i'll probably have also entered along here let me show you along from this side because the deep blue wave crossed with the light blue wave printed a green dot and it was going up look at money money was also going up here into the positive territory so what happened to price price went up you understand then we registered a red dot here because the deep blue wave always there's always an intersection between the deep blue wave and the light blue wave formed a red dot which is a bearish sign then the momentum started falling down momentum started falling initially it also formed green dots here but it wasn't enough form another red dot here and it started coming down so what could you what could you have also done you could have also taken a shot from the side you understand so you could realize that money was also heading in towards the negative territories it was negative territories because it's going back into the negative means money is leaving the assets and momentum is also coming down momentum moves different from money flow momentum goes up like this sometimes it crosses the 60 line the 60 line is your overbought line you understand when it says overbought it means a lot of people have pumped money into it and it's now price is now more reflecting it's true um the price of uh, the price of the asset has been overbought means there's so, so much money being injected in it and there's going to be a correction and it's normal so the correction happens a lot of people take their money out then it comes down again you understand so this is how it works then it comes down across the oversold territories then it also tries to build momentum up like this goes up then comes down again then went up but because money is exiting the assets you could see momentum couldn't literally go up like that so momentum try going up it couldn't go came down because already money is in the positive sorry negative territories so momentum has now momentum is not doing much you understand so 
until momentum builds here went up once again what happened to price it went up but it wouldn't be huge because money is not in the positive yet money is still like in the negative so let's see what happened to this dump it came down so into the negative territories let's see what happened here you see it came down because money is already in the negative territories already money is already in the negative territories so when momentum is also joining money in the negative territories that's a huge dump boom so basically you could have taken along again here boom momentum went up money was still lurking in the negative you understand but what happened to price price went up here i've already demonstrated this one let's go Let's go. Okay, this one. You can realize that we form a green dot here. We cross the oversold territories. Then we gain momentum. Boom, boom, boom. Went up into the positive territories. Money was also heading towards the positive territories. You understand? So money form here went up. What happened to price? Price went spiked hugely because momentum is in the positive as well as price is also in the positive so two important oxalators in the positive means pump up boom. the same way two influential oxalators in the negative means price falls hugely and how do i know this is a positive third reason there's a negative third because this is positive zero line and this negative zero line in a sense so there's a mediator line device of course, the mediator divides the F into two equal halves. The mediator, if you did your geography, don't forget, don't forget people, geography, the mediator. So this, you'll say, if, if, if in trading, if this is the mediator line, this is the zero line, it divides the F into two equal halves. This is the positive territories and this is the negative territories. Big, big dogs, you understand? So um, everything that happens here is the inverse relationship. Don't forget, it's the inverse relationship. So if he is happening positive here, it's going to be negative here. No any other stuff here. Positive means up, negative means down. But if you're a pro, if you're a pro like us, you know, sometimes you can take a shot from here because you know what's coming. It's coming to the negative third. So you can also do the inverse. It, it depends. Once you get, you know, you know, you know how it works. You become very skilled. It's you. You work your way out it's not for everybody to be like me not for everybody to be like crypto phase everyone has their own style respect it not everybody can be like even aldo jason casper all these vetted all the tech traders lanico all these um good guys you know son. you cannot become like them you can learn from them and also build on your knowledge but what i'm trying to tell you is it takes time you understand trading requires time and um you have to psych yourself and you have to take out fear how do you take out fear the thought of fear like you're losing money should be sifted out how do you sift it i i can't really tell you how to sift fear but uh you, you have to embrace reality here you know, as like every human being is going to die so basically understand the fact that if you have life you're going to die so i understand the fact that if you're trading you're going to lose that's how i see it so if i'm going to lose in trading why should i bother sometimes you have to exit a good trade sorry a losing trade to make a winning trade you understand? Know, Let's say I, I took a loss of $10,000, I'm probably making $50,000. i am just making scenarios. I'm not, I'm not saying I made a loss of $10,000, but I'm just trying to let you guys know. It takes time. So don't fear losing money once you have understand how to make money. You understand? Because um, it's part of the game. Um, you have to lose to gain sometimes. Of course, you have to lose weight to build muscles. Does it make sense? You have to lose weight. Of course, you have to lose weight to gain. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> so it, it's, 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 that's how it works. It takes time. Don't worry, people. It takes time. So I'm going to in the next video. I'm probably going to demonstrate how to scalp. Yes, yeah, scalp using lower time frames. This is higher time frames. This is for people to have time. Swing traders. You know, it takes time. Not everybody is programmed to be a trader. Not everybody is programmed. Some people learn from others the hard way. And um, I did. You know, it took me a while. We are different. Like like I said, genetically we are different. So everybody has this different way of doing stuff. But again, you can also learn from me. You can also learn from other people. But the goal is to simplify. Once you understand how market cipher works, basically trading is just a cheat code. <laughs> market cipher is a cheat code for humanity to live their lives, make money, enjoy, and um. Up. So people, I. I wouldn't want to take much of your time. This is a simplified script. It took me years to discover, work with them. And I'm here on YouTube trying to help you guys. Help me promote the channel. Take me to 100,000 subscribers. <laughs> 
let's do business people the world needs to know about what's going on blah 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 in terms of trading blah 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 yada yada, yada. let's sell market side for people let's sell market side for i know it's not for free it's not for free because someone programmed it get that in your mind people want free stuff there is nothing like a free cake in the world free things are not free you understand so um the only the, the only free place probably maybe the cemetery because there's no life there once there's life things are not free worker is worthy of his reward if you yeah, don't forget about that one so so um you can like subscribe links in the description follow me have the discord um you can also use my my link buy my case if i make commission out of you guys as normal I'm, I'm giving you free content i have to get paid for it you know what i'm saying i don't edit my screen i don't edit my videos just straight from my heart my mind my soul i can't lie to you guys i can't my 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 morals are too strong to lie to you guys so not about my morals i really don't know why i have to lie about something if it works it works use it for yourself try and help you guys make money for yourself enjoy life play games if you want to play games have fun enjoy life is simple easy thanks to market cipher and um so until then people have a nice time peace